Right, I want to show you guys a little trick that I did here. Is a, um, had a condensate pump here, okay, for an equipment room. And what I've done is we've had a problem with it uh, clogging up and stuff like that. And uh, one time the bottom of it broke. So what I did is I went out and I bought a busboy tray, set the set the condensate pump in there. And then wired up a float switch, so if it ever flow overflows, this switch will take out the take out the um, transformer, so uh, don't have to worry about it leaking through this floor. Because it's done that in the past. We'll go over here and I'll get my flashlight out. You'll probably see it better. You can see the stains on the floor. See the stains on the floor where this has leaked before. So I just installed the float switch. Uh, put this whole assembly into this this drain pan, and you can see it's got water in there. It's had water in there before, so um, this is just a secondary. It's a little uh, tip I can give you for for uh, making sure that it's uh, safe and dry. Because below us is uh, is a, a lobby for a bank, so that it was dripping on their customers' heads. So that's what they wanted. Something else too that you know. This is the uh, condensate coming out, and it always, I don't know what happened, this was before I did service on this unit, it snapped off, it's all glued in there, it doesn't have a thread in, it has a glue in, so it goes to that one inch, um, one inch piece there, and it's snapped off, as you can see, and then someone's glued it back together, I don't see any leaks, but I always check every time I come up here to service.